We've traveled the world together and had each other's backs in some of life's most challenging moments. You've always been massively supportive, both personally and artistically, from being a longtime fan of Stripped, which is how we met, to now, well, later, but you know what I mean, to now connecting and reconnecting musically with my Latina roots and understanding how important that is to me. Thank you. There happens to be a handful of women in this room who have been blessed to be your canvas, and you somehow managed to make time for all of us. I must say, I highly encourage you, as always, to take some well-deserved time off, because I'm that girl, for self-care. However, your endless hustle and passion for what you do never goes unnoticed. Etienne, you shared your battle with cancer with the world this past January, maintaining such a beautiful disposition while quietly fighting through the pain. We all know this journey has not been easy for you, and we are all so inspired by your grace your poise, and your positive energy throughout these difficult few months. Thank you. <clears throat> when I was 13, Christina's album, Stripped, had actually just came out. And I was instantly drawn and remember thinking to myself, damn, this girl could really, really sing. And her talent is definitely God-given. Her songs and lyrics, resonated with me and spoke to me in very many different ways. The art in her music videos, all the characters she plays and embodies effortlessly, all the makeup looks she created, blew me and a lot of us away. And I remember thinking, I wanna do makeup. I wanna be an artist and I have to work with her one day. Dreams really are real. I cannot believe I stand here 15 years into my career, getting an award from a woman who impacted my life so immensely and inspired me to become a makeup artist. My 13-year-old really would be very, very proud. <laughs> Dealing with cancer for the last six 